Panthers trying to extend a three-game win streak, hosting GLVC foe Quincy at home. Biggest student turnout of the year, the O'Reilly Center was rocking, and DU really fed off that energy. Early on, Alex Hall from deep. You haven't seen the last of him in this highlight. The three-point line early on for Drury was rich. First Hall, then Patterson, Panthers freeze frame. Drake wasn't done either, starting to build some confidence after his 17-point outing against Illinois Springfield. He had eight in the first half. Then off the fast break, Ian Carter. Throw it down, young fella. He's fired up. So are the Panthers. Hall finishes the first 20 with a dunk of his own. He led all scores in the first half with 13. DU up 10 at the break. Also during this game, the Panthers receiving the NCAA Game Environment Award of Excellence, so congrats to them. In the second half now, Drake Patterson continues his scoring reign, filling it up. He finished with 19, DU up 10 when Cameron Adams trying to pass it, no one there, so he shows up the mid-range game. Unexpected points. That gets a smile from him. A couple minutes later now, Jordan Wilson drives the lane and one, and just like that, the Hawks are within seven. But the Panthers doing what they struggled early in the season with, finishing. Free throws from Hall seal it. He had 19. Props to Alex Hall and Brandon Lockhart for playing 37 and 40 minutes respectively. DU wins 78-71. Uh, it was awesome. Tonight was a great environment to play in front of, and it's been, that was maybe my funnest college game. You know, it's not always the how you start, it's how you finish, and uh, we've really shown the last few games, last week or two, that uh, we're ready to play, and it's really starting to, you know, like I said, uh, earlier today, uh, we're starting to look like, you know, jury. We have a tradition here is to win. And I mean, finally, I think we're looking like that tradition is coming back. So.